What's up everybody? Uh, today I'm going to show you how to change your system strings using nothing but your iPhone or iPod Touch on firmware 3.0. This is really cool. You don't need a computer around you. You could do all, all directly on your iPod or iPhone. First thing we're going to do is go to Cydia. And there will be two applications out of Cydia we are going to download. First one we need to go to is fe Featured Packages and scroll down to one called right here which is iFile. So go ahead and install that. After you've done that, go ahead and hit your search button at the bottom and we are going to search for Slide. Space T. Once you've done that, go ahead and hit search. And the next one we're going to install is right here slide to unlock killer. So once you have got those two installed, go ahead and close out of Cydia. And next one we are going to go to is iFile, which is what we just downloaded. I am going to get this back at the beginning to show you how it works. So, from the beginning, you are going to click on var stash themes. Basically, this is just like SSH. And once in your themes, you're going to look for the slide un to unlock theme, which is right there. Go ahead and click into that. Click into folders, springboard, and pick the proper language, which here is English click on springboard and right here these are all your system strings the second one down there maybe a little bur bur blurry is a way lock label that would be your slide to unlock so let's go ahead and edit that what you're going to do is slide in between the parentheses and I am going to change this to show in Tail. Once you've done that right there, go ahead, done, save, and done. Once that is completed, go ahead and close out of iFile. And the next one we are going to go to is Winterboard. Once in Winterboard, we are going to turn on the slide to unlock killer theme. Once you've done that, back out of it let winterboard do its thing and we'll turn it off and on and there you go show and tell so this is just one system string I changed using nothing but the iPod touch you can do it on your phone as well again this is for 3.0 firmware Go ahead and slide that open and change whatever system string you like. If you do have any questions, feel free to ask, message me, and I will help you out the best I can. Alrighty, peace out.